Howdy folks, TJ here. Let's play some TI-99 games. TI-99-4A. I gotta turn off this monitor over here. This magically came out by itself. What are we gonna play? Wumpus. I've been, Hunt the Wumpus is the official name. You know, I've gotta say, I remember the name. I kind of remember the game being roguelike. But I don't remember the game. <laughs> I don't remember playing it. I may have on some computer. Is this on an Apple II? I didn't own an Apple II, but I had a friend that owned an Apple II. Was it on an Atari? I don't remember. Going back 40 you know, years, I can't remember yesterday. But I wanted to, this was going to be kind of after Parsec. That was, I think, the last game that I technically played on my TI-99. I thought, let's reconnect up my ti Actually, it's been over here all along, and I've been itching to play with it a little bit. So let's go through. This video will be rather long, because I normally read a little of the book with you, explain what's going on uh, as much as I can, and then wing it and try to play the game. I've connected the original uh, joysticks, even though I've got the ultimate bastard. Uh, for those not aware, I've got the ultimate bastard joystick, and with the right adapter, I use that on here. But, you know, for these early on things, I'm enjoying having the whole Texas Instruments experience. From the original cartridge to the original joysticks, to yell at the joysticks, to switch to something else later on. It's all in fun. So, anyway, this box says Home Computer, Texas Instruments. And the picture, you know, kind of points out it looks a little roguelike to me. And there's a big flap. Uh, this is it different. I, I don't remember. I don't think Parsec had a big flap like this that opened up. And then you're seeing the back of the booklet in here. And uh, solid state software, command module, all sorts of text. Uh, the back picture looks to be generic in terms of every box says the same thing. It's not specific to Wumpus, uh, which is interesting. But I guess it may save you on costs for printing materials. Uh, anything on the sides? Oh, look, there's a slit on the side. And if you've got the cartridge in the right direction, uh, hunt the whoopus. It says it all right there and there. So let's go ahead and open this up. And this manual kind of pulls out this way. And let's make sure I've got the cartridge. <laughs> uh, so that's an interesting idea. I kind of like uh, the way they've designed this. The cartridge is in here. And let's flick it out. This looks to be a regular, real deal, Texas Instruments, Hunt the Whoopus cartridge. Let's slip it in there, computer. And let's look at the booklet. So the booklet on the front says, Hunt the Whoopus, an exciting simulated hunt in hidden maze of caverns and twisting tunnels. Seek out the lair of the Whoopus uh, while avoiding perils along the way. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to read tons of this. I may just kind of wing the game because we're doing this together. Now, apparently, this book uh, does have a something removed. Maybe it was one of those send the barcode and you get some freebie thing. So they've stolen this. Uh, it's understandable. I'm not the original owner of this. Uh, but the back does have a story. Uh, so let's look at the story. Deep in the dark and twisting maze, there's a creature called the Whoopus. Hiding in its lair, the Wumpus waits to ambush careless explorers who enter its cavern. In Hunt the Wumpus, you play a hunter looking for clues to help you find the Wumpus and fire an arrow into its cavern. So I'm going to find the Wumpus and shoot an arrow. Okay, got it. Uh, at the same time, you must avoid the perils of the maze. Slime pits, giant bats, and the Wumpus itself. Hunt the Whoopus lets you play on any three levels of maze difficulty, easy, hard, or pro. The module also features four exciting game options that let you decide how your exploration is mapped out during the hunt. Normal displays a map of all the territory you explore as you move through the maze. I like that. Blindfolded? No, 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 I don't like that. Uh, well, I could like that. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay, uh, we won't go there. <laughs> T 
Test your memory by erasing the map behind you. I don't want to do that. Express. Instantly transport you to the end of any tunnel you enter. I don't like that. That sounds like cheating. I don't want to cheat. Blindfolded and Express <laughs> combines blindfolded and Express options for the game's ultimate challenge. Hunters beware. I, I must not understand Express then. Each hunt takes place in a new randomly generated maze. So you can play again and again without repetition. So let me, um, I'm not sure if I want to turn up the camera, but the booklet, there are, can I control this with a, a joystick? To take full advantage of the features and benefits, this command module, please read the manual completely. <laughs> uh, important keystroke sequences are summarized here. Maybe you have to use that. Uh, I don't like that. I like using the joystick. Q... Uh, then up, down, or left arrow, aim and fire the arrow. Oh, shit. I sure hope the joystick works. Uh, Q, uh, uh, just by itself reveals the map after a game. Uh, the up arrow, move upwards. Uh, start a new game using the same option selection if you used after the last game, I guess. If you used after a game. Uh, down goes downwards, left goes left. So there are arrow keys... Where the hell are the arrows? Oh, shit. That's E-S-D-X. You know those three letters, three of them spell sex? <laughs> Blindfold. <laughs> okay. We won't go there. We won't go there. Okay. Um, uh, shift R is redo. Shift Z is... And I say Z. I'm in the United States, but I am now so used to seeing a Z as Z. I don't call it a zebra. I call it a zebra. Uh, so I'm half and half. I don't know. Uh, Q, shift Q is quit. But what was Shift Z? Return to the option screen and pressing during a game. I don't remember this stuff. Uh, but anyway, it kind of shows you the picture of what this game may look like. Uh, this is a thick book for a lot of stuff. Uh, okay, it's introduction uh, using the solid state software. So all that's generic. Um, uh, getting started. Uh, well, this is now pertaining to this, so getting started, a lot of text, a lot of reading, we're just going to wing that part, uh, 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 and on to the hunt, uh, after you select an option, the computer constructs a hidden maze, the screen blanks, uh, bugle call, uh, call sounds, and the hunt begins, the game starts in an empty cavern, the blinking figure of a hunter appears in the cavern, I basically it says I need to explore, uh, I go in directions, uh, tracking down the Wumpus. The Wumpus makes its makes its layer in one of the caverns in the maze. You know you're getting near the Wumpus. I'm glad I'm reading now. I kind of reading, but I'm kind of not reading. Uh, in the maze, you know you're getting near the Wumpus when you enter a cavern with blood spots shown on the screen as large red in the cavern. So if I see large red, that's getting blood bath time. These dots appear in all caverns within two caverns of the Wumpus. So if I see red dots, uh, I'm within uh, within striking distance of the Wumpus. In the example below, eight out of the 12 caverns explored by the hunter, uh, the figure in the upper right cavern contains a blood spot. In the example below, eight out of the 12 caverns explored by the hunter, the figure in the upper right. Okay, I got it. I got it. I, this is the picture that it's talking about. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay. The Wumpus is probably somewhere in the middle uh, of the eight spotted caverns. Here's a hunting tip. If you are spotted, if you're in a spotted cavern uh, that is connected to a clear cavern, no red dot, you can explore one cavern further before you risk entering the Wumpus uh, cavern. Good to know. Okay. The trick to finding the Wumpus is to determine which cavern is more than two caverns away from all the unspotted caverns. Now, the caverns in the Wumpus layer never enter the Wumpus layer or else you lose the game. Caution, there's slime pits. Okay, uh, when you enter a cavern that has green walls instead of blue walls, you are approaching a slime pit. Slime pits are vast pools of stagnant water that fill a cavern. If you enter a slime pit, you fall and lose a game. <laughs> uh, slime pits can usually be avoided since all caverns within one cavern of the pit have green walls. But move carefully. Okay, got it. Okay, how do I shoot the arrow? Do not disturb the bats. Some of the caverns in the maze are inhabited by large bats. 
Uh, the first time you enter a cavern containing bats, a bat symbol appears in the cavern. Bats know you are there, but they ignore you for now. If you uh, later re-enter a cavern with bats, you may disturb them. So don't go back into the belfry with the bats, okay? If you do, they pick you up and carry you off and anywhere in the maze and tunnel slime pits and wumpus layers and even a cavern where you fight um, a begin, okay? Uh, then you choose a new place to live, okay? The bats may set you in either a map. Or, I don't want to go there. I, I understand. Where, how do you shoot the arrow? Once the wumpus is located, we're, the, we're almost there. Did I start this recording? <laughs> uh, when you think you know where the wumpus is, it's time to fire your arrow. You should be in a cavern or tunnel that connects to the wumpus layer. Press Q to indicate that you are ready to fire. Uh, the hunter figure turns from yellow to blue. So I'm going to turn from yellow, because I'm a Friday cat, to blue. Uh, then press an arrow key to direct the arrow into the tunnel uh, you think leads to the wumpus. The arrow uh, follows the tunnel to the next cavern. Uh, when using the wired remote controllers, press the fire button to indicate that you are ready to shoot. Okay, uh, so press the fire button, then move the lever. I'm glad I'm reading this because I would have not figured this out. If the cabin you fire into the Wumpus layer, uh, you win. If you're wrong, the Wumpus hears your arrow and comes looking for you. Oh, shit, you only have one arrow, so if you miss, you lose the game. Well, they should give you a second arrow. Come on, you bastards. Uh, I'm the son of uh, an elven... Something. Legolas. <laughs> uh, okay. I think that's enough reading. Um, there's other shit in here. At the hunt's end, it's going to give me a tally um, uh, that the this thing's over. Uh, okay, I think we've had enough. Uh, let's turn on the screen monitor. Oh, i got a crook in my neck. And then I have to turn on the... Uh, the uh, did I turn on the scare <laughs> AV? Uh, and then turn on this. I've got the hunt the whoop. It's three, two, one. Access instruments, press any key to begin. There we go. A uh, hunt the wumpus, uh, chess a wumpus. <laughs> hey, they got multiple versions on here. Wumpus uh, Jadi. Is that French too? I don't know. <laughs> Jadi. Okay, am I recording this? Okay, let's focus in on the screen. I'm already 12 minutes in. These videos typically get pretty dang long. But, you know, that's the way it goes. So, uh, choose wisely. Which one, what? I gotta hit a number. We're gonna do Hunt the Wumpus 2. The hunt is about to begin, but be careful. Oh, he fell head first. Oh, that's a big mouth. That's sweet. <laughs> hunt the Wumpus, press for E. We're gonna do easy at first. Uh, let me go off camera here for now. I gotta pick my nose. Okay, uh, normal. Normal. I gotta do that blindfold thing. Look, it's. Uh, yeah, oh, Hump the Wumpus, one. I like how it puts a little spaceship there. Oh, so I got the right joystick. That's good. Okay, so I maneuvered. There's no slime. Uh, there's no green. But look, one of his arms is green and one of them is pink. Is that a problem on my cable? <laughs> is that just this game? Okay, so let's go right. That's good. Okay, uh, now he's got two pink legs. <laughs> oh, green is, is green slime? Oh, go back. Oh, I gotta lose this shit. Uh, uh. Okay, that's good. Good. Oh. Oh, what's that red thing? Oh, that's the red, that's the red blood. Oh, shit. Okay, so I'm within two, right? <coughs> oh, I came down at the bottom. That's weird. <laughs> uh, oh, I'm still within two. Let's go back down. Okay, I think it's within two, right? Okay, let's go left. Nothing. Okay, so it, it's down here someplace, I think. Well, let's let's try this. Go up. Oh, look at that. Oh, shit, that could be the second one. I'm going to shoot an arrow. Uh, shoot an arrow up. So fire up. Apparently not. Fire up. <laughs> Is it this one? Fire up. You can't do fucking fire. Oh, that's what you do. Oh, shit, I died. Oh, look at those eyes. <laughs> uh, okay, oops, the wumpus got you. I I, I didn't fire right. Uh, oops, the wumpus got you. Tally board, uh, zero. Uh, look at that wumpus. He's fiendish looking son of a bee's weasels. And then zero, uh, zero. Okay, so press Q for, uh, let's try this again. So uh, 
uh, how do you go back? <laughs> uh, back quit. Uh, I, I want to go back. Uh, up arrow? Okay. I don't know how I did. Okay, up. Oh, I'm going all over the dungeon. Oh, green slime. Oh! Okay. Now, does this wrap around this way? That, that's, that's the spooky part. I don't know. Uh, oh, there's a bat! But I'm not going to go and disturb him. So I'm within two. Uh, so it could be here. I'm going to shoot the air. So push the button. Shoot. No, you bastard. I didn't get him. Wait, what's that say? Did I get him? Wait a second. <laughs> what does that the book say? Uh, tally board. Oh, no, he's got two and I've got zero. Okay, I get it. No, I didn't get anything. Okay, so. Uh, okay, let's try again. I want to get one Wumpus. Green slime. Okay. Uh, up. Oh, it was a two. So, I, is he here? I'm, I'm not going to shoot and waste my air. I'm going to go one more. Now, it could be here or here, right? There's, there's two. So, he, I'm going to shoot down. Shit! You... I was going to say the F word, you bastard. You son of a bee's weasels. Okay, uh, maybe I'm not. Getting, maybe I need to die uh, a, a death without shooting an arrow first, so I can get better bearings. Oh, look at this one! Oh, geez. oh, oh, there's a bat. Oh, no. Okay, there's gonna be red down there. See, red. Now I I'm just gonna go left. I'm gonna go left. I'm not gonna shoot an arrow. Left. Okay, so if I would have shot the arrow, I would have killed that son of a bitch. So I'm right. There's two. Uh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> okay, go. Okay, back. Slime. Okay, there's red. Nope. Okay, let's go. Let's go up. Oh. Is he here? Oh, shit. Which one? Within two, two. I think he's here. Okay, shoot down. Got him! Yeah! <laughs> Look, he kind of looked like Barney there. <laughs> the kid's Barney. He looked a little bit less ferocious than this thing. But look at that. Okay. I like this. It's a little thinking game. One more time. I like it. Okay, left. I want to see the wrap around, though. See, if I go right. Yeah, he does go over there. Slime. Okay, so now I know there's a red, and there's probably a red here. Okay, so he... Oh, shit. Do I want... No, I'm going to go up here. Okay, within two. Uh, two? Oh, shit. Okay, that's fine. Oh. I, I, I think he's here, right? Two? I'm going to shoot down. Oh, you... Oh, you son of a bitch. One more time, and then we'll call this game a wrap. He's kicking my ass. Tally-ho. Fartnick. Okay. I like this game. This is cool. Oh, shit. Oh, you son of a bitch. No, I can't die. I love that face, though. Look at that. Okay, one more time. This is really fun. I like this. Now, I don't remember it. me playing it. Oh, there's two. Oh, shit. Oh, there's a bat. Okay, is he here? Oh, that's curving around. So he could be up and he... Or he could be here. Let's go down. Oh, shit. No, let's go see... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, there's two. Uh, think, think. <laughs> oh, what? Oh! There's multiples here. Is he here? I think he's... I think he's here. One, two... Oh, shit. 
Oh, shit. Okay, let's go left. Okay, not there. Oh, I'm afraid. <laughs> oh, it's too much. How many wumpuses are in this thing? I'm, I, I must not con completely understand. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I think he's here. What's this? Oh. I'm going to shoot. I'm just going to... One. No, I think he's here. Oh, you fucker. <laughs> okay. You get the gist of the game. I like it. I like it. It's a, it's a little bit scary. It's a little bit not scary with the Barney. It looked, at least it looked like Barney. I like it. So... And look at it. It looks beautiful on this big old 43-inch TV. Anyway, thanks for watching the video. Another Texas Instruments TI-99 4A game. Hunt the Wumpus. Thanks for watching. Bye.